Hello everybody, my name is Aaron with the Helsum Guru team and today we're going to tell you about our wholesale pricing option for products in your Helsum account. With wholesale pricing, it gives the option for wholesale prices for specific customers and specific products. For wholesale pricing, our first step will be changing the settings for our product and entering in the wholesale pricing options. So let's go on and head over to products to get started. Now keep in mind, we have a video that goes over all of the steps for creating retail products and we recommend checking it out if you need more information. Today we're going to enable the pricing on a specific handbag in our clothing sale for wholesale. So let's go ahead and click on our product. In our product overview, we can see we have a regular price set at $112. So to enable wholesale pricing, let's go ahead and head over to advanced pricing. So first we're going to enable wholesale pricing and we're going to click save. Now we see the fields pop up for our wholesale price and our cost price. So let's go ahead and enter in our wholesale price at 80 and we'll enter in our cost at 60. Keep in mind, wholesale price is the price that your enabled customers will pay and cost will be your internal cost for the product. Next, if you have add-ons created in your product category, you can have wholesale pricing for these add-ons as well. To do this, enable include add-ons. In our example today, we're going to leave the add-on pricing as off. So once we've got our pricing in place, let's go ahead and click on save. Now that we've set the wholesale price for the product, we now need to enable wholesale pricing for our customer. So to do that, let's enable this option by beginning at the customer section. So we're going to go ahead and select our customer. And under advanced options, we're going to enable wholesale and we're going to click save. Now that this setting has been enabled, when your customer logs into the online store or when you manually create an invoice for them, they will have wholesale pricing enabled. Now keep in mind, with this setting enabled, only the customer will receive this pricing and it prevents other customers from receiving this wholesale price. Now that we've enabled our product and our customer for wholesale pricing, let's see it in action. So we're going to go to our online store and we're going to get logged in. So now we're going to find our product. And here in our product overview, we can see the wholesale price that we set along with a wholesale price indicator. Also, when we create an invoice for the customer manually, we will be able to see that wholesale pricing in place on the invoice. And there you have it. So with wholesale pricing, you can enable that special pricing for your specific customers to suit your needs. Thanks for joining us for another tutorial video today, and we hope to see you again in the near future.